day that the Lord has made. We shall rejoice and be glad in it. Hallelujah, hallelujah. To God be the glory for all the good things he's done in our lives. Hallelujah, praise the Lord. Love you. He's the one that wanted to, it, uh, the thing is coming from man and, and it's very important for us always to let them know where that word is coming from. You know what I mean? It's so important for us to know this is what the word of God says. I, I seen to some of my, even one of my friends that listen to these videos, he sit there and say a lot of cases we 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 say that man wrote. You know, he, that's one of his biggest things. You know, he'll listen to the video. God bless you, brother. Uh, anyway, he'll listen and he'll say, who wrote it, right? He, and he all keeps saying, man wrote it, right? Uh, not, even though I say, no, I'm inspired by God. No, no, man wrote it. That, that, that's who wrote it. And, and we don't even know who the actual person who wrote it. Uh, but the whole intent behind that is to get people to put it down at man's level. Yeah, right. and the scripture really points that out. Yeah, you know, and then they, they, they will never grasp that beckoning from God because they can't receive it as such. Exactly, and and look, look, look what came to mind while you were saying that. Um, I was thinking about Moses and 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 the children of Israel. You know, when when they, God talked to them on the mountain of Mount Zion. And, and remember they said, what did, you remember what they told Moses after they heard God speaking? You remember, what, what did they tell Moses after they were afraid, right? They heard, they heard God speaking, right? Yeah. And, and, and what, they, you, they you, Moses, you, you don't talk to him. <laughs> you, you right, because look, 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 the reason why it was because you remember that further down in the chapter they went back to the golden calf right you you, you remember they sit there and say we don't know what happened to that man moses he's been up there for 40 days and 40 nights oh man i, I you can still see me catch I, I put that generator on today <laughs> yeah i can still see you it just got a little darker that's all you can you hear me yeah okay let me put my speaker back on the uh I knew I, was, I tried to use that that generator today. I'm I'm gonna keep pressing without it. <laughs> Just one second. I can't hear. Uh, I get off and I put on that TV. Let me test my speaker. Speaker's that test speaker. It's working. Okay, I hear you. We're gonna, we're gonna press with it. Let me make sure I get. Okay, we'll keep pressing without the uh, the light. You can see me in the background anyway. I can see myself. <laughs> Hallelujah. <laughs> well, anyway, the, the the point is that is they when they they wanted to put man in between them and God because then they can sit there and rebel against man because once they recognize those scriptures you're showing once they recognize that god is and i think I, i'm not sharing them anymore am i i'm not sharing right once they recognize who god is those scriptures you just read is saying now they have they give uh what you call it credence to it mm -hmm. right because because it's real them it's real to them and 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 i think that's the only hope and expectation we have is that when we teach the word of god we we just have to let plant that seed in people's lives until they let that word become real to them make sense well you know it makes a lot of sense but uh one thing that uh came to mind was uh, Malcolm X. Okay. We definitely should grab on to a pattern that he, he used in his teaching. He would always say the honorable, honorable Elijah Muhammad 
says such and such. So they knew it was not his word. So likewise, I think maybe you should start making that precedence that the God of, of creation right. says such and such. The one true God says such and such. Yes. Yeah, well, in other words, it's says huh? such and such. Yeah. And Jesus Christ, the Son of God, says this. And 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 I think we need to make sure that that is our our mantra, I should say, because that would make sure that the glory and the honor always will go to God and will stay where it is supposed to. And I think it would also put us in check as far as us adding self to it. Yeah, like, you yeah. Know what I'm yeah. So, so then it would also make us, you know, it would be like in Kairos, you know, the riverbank. It would have an upper and lower control in it yes. to keep us, you know, in the boundaries of what God has given us, and that that is what we we did because many of many of us will go on and 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 start to to give our interpretation of what the word says, which is 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 what we we do from a revelation point of view when god give us revelation on his word so that we have a better and a more profound understanding of what he's trying to say especially when it pertains to us as individuals then we should say so yeah it should always be the word of god said and so I'm, I'm I'm starting to lean toward that so that you know they could never make a point against me. They yeah. have to be making a point against God. Right. You know what I'm saying? They would have right. to be uh, refusing the word of God. They would have to. They, their conflict should never be with me anyway. Right. And that's what some people. That and I think that's what that's what people. Uh, that's ministering sometimes the, the gospel preaching the gospel whether they're you know minister or, or person is to sit there and say what came to my mind when you're speaking is the the we can just do what jesus said it is written so when you you know let people know well you know it's written in the scriptures that blah 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 right uh mm -hmm. you might even say i may paraphrase this a little because i don't have i'm not reading right out of the book or yeah. you say hey look I'm, I'm gonna i'm gonna pull up my my uh my app and i'm going to read this to you but right it's it's so important for them and us to to just like jesus glorify the father right and and even the word he sit there and say you know when he dealt with the devil what's written yeah. and you'll find a lot of cases that most people try to they want to they want to get you off that word anyway and yeah, try to make it a person. conflict between you in that individual exactly, you know, exactly. It, it's how it's how they receive the word it goes right back to first thessalonians 2 13. yeah it's how they receive the word of god right how they receive the truth that's being told to them when they right. receive it as something that myron is saying then that's what they're going to receive exactly and they're going to have opposition against it but when they See it as truth. Come on. If they see it as the word of God, then they must take heed because they're held accountable to that. Yeah. Yeah. Well, you know, and, and I think that's the that's why it's so important for us to let them, you know, I was that woman when that scripture was said it said where where the glory of the gospel is revealed, right? We 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 that's the key to it is being able to let them see the gospel being revealed to them. 
which is Jesus Christ. And 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 don't forget, we got the opposition that wants to do what the God of this world has blinded the eyes of those. Uh, and he he continues to do that. That's why even when your your thorns are put, your, your your crown of thorns in the background is that there is a a barrier. There's a there's a cover that that people have on their eyes, spiritual eyes, that they 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 try to see it on you. And I think that's why. You, oh man, really? You just said it. Is that Jesus always pointed back to the Father? Yeah. You know what I mean? Always. He, he always. He, come on, bro. He did. And then, fact, even when he didn't say it specifically, the kingdom of heaven is likened to. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. And that's why he said the truth will make you free. Yeah. Right. And, and that's another thing. That truth is so powerful that it reflects kingdom principles. Come on, so that bro. <laughs> when someone went against what Jesus' agenda was and right. it was true, he had to honor it. Right. He had to honor when that woman said even the dogs eat from the eat the crumbs from the table, the master's table. Come on. That was a fact and a truth. And Jesus was moved by it because it reflects truth which re reflects it, it no it speaks truth which reflect kingdom practices exactly it, it, it really did and he had to honor that <laughs> he did he had to honor that he had to honor the woman that said i have no no husband yeah it, it, it just kind of you know you speak true because <laughs> the man that you have now is not your husband when the when the centurion said just speak the word Oh, and I know he had to honor that. Woo! The way he said, I have not yet seen such things. Come on, brother. Come on. Come on. So truth is such a a godly thing that it it is a God, whether it exposes corruption or it speaks to God directly. Exactly. Yes. Yes, so it, 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 it is a powerful thing. It is powerful. You know, it's, <laughs> it is powerful. I was sitting there. I don't know if you saw my. Uh, I was. I was. Uh, it's, I like what you said just now. Uh, it, it brought in mind that I don't know if you saw our little text we had with the uh, the most murderous people in the country. Uh, did you see that text going back? I, I saw it, but. It's. I left it alone for a lot of reasons. I want you know this. You can take any fact any and make it say what you wanted to say. You exactly. That's and, what I'm trying to say. And the information gathering can only be what you want it to be if the, <laughs> if the resources that you are used are the resources that you use. Woo! So say. <laughs> that one one ethnic group is doing something greater than another you have to go global and then look at it on a global basis and see what's going on here so <laughs> just go from okay well let's look at these inner cities well, obviously, the inner cities are, there's more urban <laughs> people <laughs> in color in inner cities than there is Caucasian folks. So hey, let, let's, let's even the playing field here and let's do research there. But these things are not edifying to the glory of God. So why even get caught up into these such conversations? I mean, the Bible says don't even you know don't don't get caught up in these things well it's a genealogy but i wanted i wanted to draw the point of the like you were saying about truth and facts right yeah that what i what i wanted to show is that when when man kind when when, when mankind would try to i call put people in boxes right and yeah. then say what what what, what, I, what i wanted to bring out was there was a statement of fact made right and you can say okay this is true right 
But the problem I wanted to say what you said is that, like you said, you can make it sound any way you want to, but but the truth matters and words matter, right? When 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 I all I wanted to bring out was the fact is that you can't put a whole group of people based on a few number of people and call the whole group murderers. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. it, it's, it's a point behind it. The point was, because you didn't read the rest of the text, it was this, I'm saying is, it wasn't saying, you can't say blacks are the most murderous people in the country based on 9,000 uh, murderers out of 41 million blacks in the country is what i'm trying to say you can't mm -hmm. you can't you can't elevate the whole group based on a fall number of people yeah, but that, 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 that's that's what i wanted to make sure everybody understood don't 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 make it don't try to make a blanket statement because then that becomes a that's not a true statement then right when you do it that way you should say out of the 21,000 death deaths that occurred only 9,000 of them were from African Americans and then 7,000 out of Caucasian mm -hmm. of that small group blacks led that pack but they, need to, they need to give give the, the, the full context context, context. Of it. yes sir that's specific what I'm trying to say during these specific times these specific parameters yeah this is what we have right. but it's not it's a it's a blank statement but you know it, you you can find like we go right back you can find that that truth is lacking and you know the, the and the reason go for, to say that is to say and, and the reason i want to add to it is that also applies to us and our faith. What I'm saying is what...